here? I'm good. I'm just here chilling, you know, with my little puppy. I love it. I love it. Oh, you're an icon. I love you. Let me just <laughs> let me just say, please. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, thank you, baby. So are you. I love I love watching your react videos. I like rarely see the episodes. Um yeah. but I will see them when 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 you react to them. Yeah, uh, but when I literally when I saw you, I think it was in season one, when I saw your comment on my video, I was like, wait, hold on a second. I'm like, I was like freaking out. I'm like, holy shit, like I didn't think. And then I saw the <laughs> I was like, oh dead girl. Like, wait, you're amazing. <laughs> Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. So it's so lovely to have you here. Thank you for doing this. Thank you for being a part of this of little course. chat. Like, I'm so excited because literally you are one of my favorite characters. Also, Lilo is <laughs> my favorite character you, on the show. Listen, what, okay, literally, what's it like being the best character, having Lilo be the best character? <laughs> the show, in my opinion. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I, it's fun. I mean, I've, Lila has gotten a lot of love, um, a lot of love both seasons. And I'm just, um, it's, it's great. It's amazing. I think, um, I'll never really, I haven't really gotten used to being recognized yet. And it doesn't happen too often, but when it does, I'm just like, maybe. Okay, bitch, we'll take a picture. Um, and then, um, yeah. Oh my God. The, the amount of love that Lila has gotten is um amazing and see i told you he'd come look the toby oh my god he's so <laughs> cute his, I full love name is king. <laughs> his full name is king tobias the third there is no first or second i just yeah. thought it sounded the best That's but i just call him my little cup his little jumper is actually the cutest thing i've ever seen like i'm not lying oh, he has a full closet Oh, as he should. You know what? I support that. Like a full closet. Yeah. Me, <laughs> and he gets around what he's thinking. What'd you I say? Know. I said, me as a parent, though, like, I would be the same. Like, you oh, know, 100%. 100%. I used to talk so much shit about people who used to t um, treat their animals like, um, like kids. And yeah. now I'm convinced that my dog came out of my vagina. I just do. <laughs> I'm convinced. Yeah, he's 100%. just perfect not to. Yeah, he's uh, it's my baby. I'm just like, he's my child. Like, I love him. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> like, anything happens to him, I will, like, burn the world down. Like, it's just my Oh, pressure. I would kill for Toby. Oh, yeah. I would commit murder for Toby. Yeah, like, the first second I had my baby, I was like, his name's Ollie. I was like, I'll die for you. Like, I would literally die for you. Like, it was one second. <laughs> I'm like, yeah. Because I never knew what puppy dog eyes meant until I got a puppy. And yeah. then I was like, okay. Yeah, I, I know. I, I totally relate. I have I've had Toby since he was like six weeks, and he could fit in my hand. Oh, oh, he's just the best. So okay, so I watched this. So obviously, I watched this season of Sex Lives of College Girls, yes. and listen, as I, I told you, so all your one, all your lines in the show, your comedic timing on this show is insane. Like oh, you have the best you. lines, even when you're not there, and someone's like, "Oh, Leela did this." It's just it's funny. <laughs> like everything have you it, did you improvise any of your lines this season or in season one yeah I'll, um uh i would say about like 30 percent of them are like 30 to 40 percent of them are like improvised yeah um yeah and i think i mean as as time goes on and and as we get more seasons um the writers just do a great job at like kind of molding um the character to you and um and and like because there'll be times where i'm reading the script and i just be like oh my god i would i would actually say this <laughs> um but yeah um yeah and a lot of like the buttons that you'll see on the scenes um um will be like improvised um or like just having fun i don't know it's just it's just it's just it, it's fun and it's and it's fun being Lila, someone who doesn't really have like the world's best filter, so like, yeah, yeah, just have uh, so much to play with. And, um, honestly, if they would just like let me go on forever, I would go on forever. <laughs> like, honestly, that should dedicate the entire episode to Lila because I'm telling any episode, I'm down, in, yeah. I literally, as I'm watching this this season, right, there was like a few episodes where you weren't in the, in the episode, there was a few of a uh, couple of them, and I was like, I'm really sad. I was like, <laughs> notice i personally notice leela's absence in the show i'm like no this episode isn't as funny without her in it 
Ah. Like you make, you elevate. Then this is this is testament to you too. You actually, and this is look, I could be just my opinion, but I think a lot of people could agree. You, my elevate. mother agrees. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. You elevate the episodes to a higher standard because it's your presence on the show, which is amazing. Thank and you. that's a true testament to you. So, like, I'm honestly, I told you, I'm a huge fan, huge fan. <laughs> Everything. Everything that you say, I'm just, my favorite lines was, I think it was in season one and you were like, a journal, like I love. Oh, yeah, 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 I, yeah, yeah. Was that line improvised or was that? No, that was, that was written. The The part that was improvised was, um, boom, you're welcome, Shakespeare. <laughs> I love that. And then there was another <laughs> one that you said, um, it was, I think it was in season two, it was, um, uh, to Kanan about the cash register. It's like, what are you, the fuck are you so slow at the cash register? Oh, I felt yeah. that. I felt that. Yeah, so that wasn't improvised, but that was changed on the day because the original line, it was something very wordy. And sometimes, I mean, English isn't my first language, but I've been saying it like, you know, a long fucking time. So I mean, yeah. pretty well. But sometimes it'll like, it'll still get me if it's too wordy. Um, So the, the writer was like, just put it in your own words. Um, And that's what came out. Um, that's... See some it's genius. It's genius. <laughs> You're my favorite part of the show. How um how similar are you as your is your character and you? How similar are you and Leela? Very similar. I would say a, um I pull a lot. I pull a lot from um my own um personal experience. Um yeah, and I think I mean that's how I've I've always really been as an as as an actor. Um I'll really like ask the question like, well, how would I respond um in this situation? Um, and I find that like I it's it's more real that way. It's more it, it it seems like more of a human being that way. Yeah. Um and that's the type of work that I really respond to. If 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 like if you can like really trick me and like be like, oh my God, that's that's them outside of this. I, it, it's fascinating to me. Um, so I tried, I, I try a lot um, for it to come um, from myself. You yeah, know? No, you can tell. It's just because I mean, I watch some of your TikToks. Like I follow you on TikTok. So like some, I, I can see, I see some of Leela coming through. I'm like, yeah, like it's, I get that kind of same vibes. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's just, I told you, your personality just shines through and it's just, it's so lovely to see. Like, you're Thank just, you. yes, like I will, I will be that person who will follow your career moving forward. Oh, like, baby. Girl, Thank you. You. <laughs> you got a fan here, girl. Don't worry. <laughs> By the way, speaking of your TikTok, you can sing, and I was proud yes. to know this. <laughs> I, you should have seen my jaw drop when I <laughs> looked at my. Oh my god, <laughs> you're amazing. Thank you. We have a lot of singers on the show. We have a lot of singers on the show. We have, I mean, it's myself, Renee. Yeah. Um, Aaliyah can blow um uh um pauline can sing like she she if she plays i think it's either the ukulele or the piano it might be both i don't know but she's like musically inclined um and so we keep on pushing for um and even Umber, Umber would say that she can't sing but she could carry a tune you know what i mean okay. like it's not like there have been people who have had less and done more you know what i mean yeah yeah, yeah. um and and so we keep on pushing for like a musical episode and stuff, but we'll see if the if they, obviously y'all need to do is y'all need to sing in season three. Y'all need to get together or like and something must happen. A fundraiser or someone sings or something happens. Something happen. I want to do because the camp inside of me wants to do like I want someone to get amnesia or something, and then <laughs> they have like a full on like fantasy sequence. Like yeah. I just want everyone to be in like obnoxious costumes, singing like I don't fucking know, like dream, like 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 I don't know, like I don't even know, I don't know. There's something like that. We need to manifest that because I feel like y'all are too talented to not do it. It's money on the table, is what it is. Literally, either sequence or even like a fun. You know, honestly, Lila would like hold some. Like, you should hold like a singing competition or like some like a uh, mic open mic night. At yeah, 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 yeah. You get like some hot guys in or something. Like Lila would do that. Oh my gosh, yeah. <laughs> like full serenading them. Lila would sing. Lila would sing like it's raining men, but she would like make it a ballad. Yeah, oh my and, god! Like, would actually have men cascading from the ceiling. Yeah, she. <laughs> That's what Lila would. Really? 
<laughs> literally envisioning that right now. Yeah, isn't it amazing? Think, why the and like the Pepsi that? delivery guy would be there at the end with like her. Oh with yeah. Her this this king, this Leela's new booty, uh, her new booty listen. <laughs> you love the Pepsi man. <laughs> I do too. I'm trying to get her a little permanent little um a, a little boot thing. Yeah, I think honestly season three, I think it's time Leela gets some action, don't you think? We should see it. Uh, I think it's, it's beyond time. I've been put yeah. I've been putting that in season one. I was like, we need to see Leela fucking because you know that shit is hilarious. Yeah, we need some everyone else has one. It's time for Leela to shine and become honestly she's a main character. We <laughs> No matter, we, I'm telling you, we need to get her some loving, like something needs to happen. Yes. Because it's yes, the yes, same yes, time. Yes, yes. Okay. And, oh man, it's it's time. It, it really is, to be honest. <laughs> okay. I'm still thinking the, it's raining, man. I just think that's so funny. Like, it's, that's yeah, it, it, it's so Lila. For the ballad, it'd be like funny. smoke and they'd be like, like be so um, strobing lights. Yeah. Yeah, like it'd be so. The reason why the Sips pay workers' pay is cut is because she's used all the expenses on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because it would be at Sips, wouldn't it? <laughs> yeah, like there's like, um, we're getting on the pay, but it's all this like smoke effects. She's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, um, man. She's like the Ava of like Abbott Elementary, where like you're like the Ava of Sex Lives of College Girls. Like, oh my God. That's such a compliment. I love that. I'm story. not serious. I'm telling you, I get that vibe. And it's I love her so much. I'm obsessed with her. I, that's a crossover that there are a lot, a lot of crossovers that I think would be so much fun. But that. one of them is is Sex Lives of Abbott. I just think like it's so funny. Sex Lives of Abbott. No, honestly, if yeah. if Leela and Ava ever met, <laughs> I think the world would come up. <laughs> that's too. They they're just oh my god. That would implode. That would be the best <laughs> thing. To they ever would imagine. either be like the worst enemies or like thickest thieves yeah and true you really so go be, like intimidated by each other like oh what the you know it's sus of each other at first it's like who is this other like alpha yeah the and then maybe yeah like, eventually like oh, yeah, 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 i'm yeah. up with you like yeah, can't yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> oh man that's so we know what we should manifest that crossover i don't know how it's gonna happen but we should make it happen. <laughs> i'm just saying we should make it happen <laughs> <laughs> What other shows would you want to cross over with with Sex Lives? White Lotus. Lotus. Oh my god! Listen, when I tell you, you you must be on season three of that show. I am trying so I I that, that one I'm actually that one is actually on my vision board. Yeah. Um, I would love to play anything on that show. Um, it's so smart and sexy and and funny. And fucking Jennifer does her thing on that show, and um, it's a it's 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 beautiful. It's it's one of those shows that like, as as a watcher, as an audience member, I'm like salivating. But as an artist, I'm salivating too because it's yeah. just like, it's just so good. I can definitely see some kind of thing. I mean, if you don't get, they need to cast you. I'm going to call out to the producers, the casting people. <laughs> I'm, it's like this official like manifest. We're going to manifest this. Yes. Shit. I think oh, you'll be an God. asset. And if you, so if your character, if you were to be on season three, what kind of like shenanigans you think your character would get up to? Oh my gosh. What I, would... Up to? Like... <laughs> <laughs> I would. Online, I was like, I think I posted like a singing video and I was like, I was like, uh, like a lounge singer. I was like, again. Um, and there was this one comment that was like, there was like, no, no, no. Like, um, 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 something along, I'm going to paraphrase, but so there are a lot of lines that like, um, this person wanted to see POC colors who were just like rich and unapologetic. Yeah. And she was like, so maybe like a rich, like a, like a, like a famous, like pop star. And I was like, Oh, I can, I can get behind that. Um, so my character would be like this, like uh, generation Z pop star. Um, and she's like, she doesn't give a fuck. She's like always on drugs, fucking all of the men that walk by. Yeah. And then I don't know. I think I would want to have just like a glorious death. I don't know. I think a glorious be death. <laughs> yeah. And then have one of the, and then, and then the, the twist is that like, I didn't die. Like I faked my own death. I don't know. I don't know. The science <laughs> 
<laughs> That's it'd be like some like full on like dramatic as fuck funeral. And, yeah, like full. Like, her, body would be, like, her body would like be like taken down like on like some like thing and like. Yes, you think it's her funeral? No, exactly. Because you think it's her funeral, but it's her comeback tour. <laughs> no, oh my yeah, maybe it's like a pop star who's like not you know has like kind of gone down a little bit and just trying to make a comeback. Yes, yes, but, like, like her image is like all fucked up because of the drugs and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. And then, okay, you know what? We're planning, that, you know? we're planning this shit out. This is good. This is good content. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and of course, the, um, that's actually hilarious. I fucking love that. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna make it happen. If honestly, it's better happen. I'm gonna. Oh, and I can't wait. Need it to happen. Vision board is happening because. Um, <laughs> Any show that you would be a part of, you you would be an asset. Like that would be lucky to have. Let me tell you, and that's truly, I mean that. Thank but you. Really, um, so I'll, so back to sex lives. So with so Leela this season, obviously she became manager of Sips and she became part of the Foxy. So we got to branch out this season with her, and she got to do so many different things. How was that? How was you know? You, I mean, you're becoming part of the Foxy, which is really cool. So like. How was that in season two? Oh my god, it's fun. One being out of that fucking uniform, and now yeah. permanently because now she's gonna get like she doesn't have to wear that shirt ever again. Yeah, and it was fun just having scenes um with like more of like the main four girls, you know, mm. um because they were blast on and off the camera. So it's just like I get to go to work every day and just like shoot the shit, and it's great. I love it, and I think um when I didn't find out. Um, that she joined the Fox. To, like I, I find everything pretty much either the night before when we get the script, <laughs> or at the reading table. Yeah. And that one was one that I found out at the reading table. Her joining the Foxy in the first oh, episode. Okay. And I was immediately obsessed. I was like, this makes perfect sense. Lila is so fucking funny. Um, um, and she's so dramatic and yeah, it just makes so much more sense. I do wish like, I mean, I do wish they, they could have done more with Leela and the Foxy. I like, but it, this, the format is hard on this show because we have such a, um, it's, it, it's about the four main girls. Yes. But it's truly an ensemble cast when you think about it. Yeah. Um, and just because we have so many people with different like individual storylines and stuff. Mm -hmm. Um, and we only get half an hour. You know what I mean? So in that regards, like, I totally understand. Um, also. Um, <laughs> <laughs> the episodes are too short. Like, either I I agree. Get, we need some more episodes because 10 episodes to me isn't enough. Or we should have <laughs> extended episodes. But, like, yeah, either, probably, like, I, I feel agree. like the show probably started off as the four main girls. But then I feel like as the show's gone on, we branched yeah. up Kane and Leela. We met all these other people. And now it's, like, I don't see the yeah. show without them. Like they need to be. Yeah, forced, I agree. So, you know, and like even even if it was like freaking like like ten or fifteen minutes per episode, like you know what I mean, like a forty five. Like it would just help flush out so much more. And yeah, um, yeah, I agree. You know, yeah. It's only yeah. something that you can do in. I mean, they do a good job for what they do in the you know the thirty minutes or whatever, but it's. Oh yeah, they, yeah. Not enough. Well, for me as a fan, like it's not. I want. I want because like I want more. But like, <laughs> you deserve your. Me I'm too, it. <laughs> yeah, we need more. I need an episode. I need season three. Mindy, you're watching. Um, <laughs> respectfully, I need an episode centered on Leela's character. Thanks. <laughs> on Leela, thank you. The whole episode. I want <laughs> that story. I want everyone to know everything. We need it. The <laughs> audience needs it. She's a fan favorite, in my opinion. Have you looked at oh. as a fan favorite? <laughs> I see edits of you on of Leela on TikTok and I'm like, yeah, this is it. <laughs> it's just I still don't get used to that. I'll be scrolling and yeah. then I'll be like, oh my god, this bitch looks like me. Cause it is me. <laughs> it is me. And then you had that TikTok that went viral. And, and then it was like, oh my god, Leela. Oh, the one where I'm talking about waxing my coochie. Yeah. <laughs> I love I that. did not expect I was like the the it's the one TikTok it actually got like a million views. Yeah, the one that, like, that's the one that just has to go viral. Like that's the one. I, I was like, <laughs> I guess the people want to know about my coochie. I mean, the people have spoken. Like it is. Who am I to deny them? Exactly, mm -hmm. the algorithm has spoken. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Um, but I love. I was in the comments and I was like, "Oh my god, Lynn, my favorite character!" Like the whole comments, everyone was like, "Oh my god, what?" I'm like that's right, as you deserve. As <laughs> <you> deserve. <laughs> yep. 
Oh man. Um, I so who do you have? A, who's your favorite actor to share scenes with in Sex Lives? Do you have a favorite actor to like? Oh my gosh. Have any I mean, role in? I love them all. I I really do. I mean, um, I love them all. I mean, I love having. I mean, this season I loved having more scenes with Umre. I didn't have. I didn't have any scenes with her last yeah. season. Um. And I love acting opposite her. I love my scenes with Pauline and and Kanan. Oh my God, Kanan, Chris, <laughs> <laughs> and Chris. Yeah. I think. Yeah. Um, I think. I mean, it, those are the two that I have my most scenes, and so I spend most of my time with them um, yeah. on and off uh, um, when we're shooting, and um, and I just think it just creates chemistry. So like, it shows. Uh, when we're like when it's like the three of us bantering and stuff yeah um yeah so i would say those those two different groups are my favorite yeah we're gonna branch Lila out in season three we're gonna get her to know everybody in the show like it's just, yes! just you know, i mean we had you and um i was like Lila and whitney share a little kiss at the fifth you know when she was trying to get her oh yeah we did. so cute oh, I love, <laughs> god bless i love it <laughs> we had that little moment i love that moment i was like that's just so cute like it's not seeing a little for that friendship there like it's yeah you know scenes with Whitney and Leela too so it's nice that they have that bond even though you don't really get to see it much like they're still friends you know so it's it's like I love that yeah I think you can really understand um you really understand that like outside of the outside of what we see um you know they're friends and that's yeah, yeah, yeah. and then <laughs> Charmaine Raphael <laughs> <laughs> That was one of my favorite scenes to film. Oh my gosh, that one! I oh my god, the the director for 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 that little thing outside, and right now his name is escaping me, and I'm being a horrible person right now because I can't remember his name. Put it in the comments. We'll look it up afterwards. Put it in the comments. I apologize because when I tell you this is my favorite director out of the whole season, <laughs> and I mean it, I'm just so bad with names. I swear to God, I've been knowing motherfuckers for 10 years and I'm still like, is it with the Y or I? Um, it's my name, Sarah. And I'm like, ah, I'm so sorry. Um, but that was my favorite shit to shoot this season because he really just let me go. Yeah. He um, he was like, um, he was like, just have fun. Um, and I, oh my God, there must've been like a good, like, 10 minutes of just shit that he's just like keep going keep going yeah um, and so when the episode came out i was like i have no idea what they're gonna use because they're obviously not gonna use the full 10 minutes yeah but that should have that should have <laughs> release the 10 minute cut everyone <laughs> HBO Max. We want that. everyone's gonna want that now we want the 10 minute <laughs> footage release that's funny um, did you come up with Charmaine Raphael? Like, did you all like did they actually come up with the name? That was that, that was in the script. Okay, the that script. was in the script. Okay, yeah, yeah. But <laughs> I whole, like just stripper, stripper name. <laughs> Doesn't it sound like a little stripperish? But like in a great way. I'm looking up the director because it's really bothering me. I'm not like trying Don't to do it. You need to be like rude as like it's gonna bug you the whole day. Yes, David Stassen. Oh, okay, there we go. David, 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 if you see this, I am so sorry. You know I love you. I told you I loved you. I told you that I wanted you back um, for the next season. Oh, wait. Wait, no, I'm such a liar. David Sesson was another male director. <laughs> <laughs> Let's, whoa. Let's keep okay. it. Because he did a lot of, like, outdoor shots. Because uh, that's, that, that's the thing that fucked me up is that... So like everything that you, all the scenes that you see outdoor, um, like that's like the strike scenes or like the scene with with um, Pauline and I, and I'm like, I'm sorry, I yelled at you. Um, and then the time you see the girls outside, that was actually saw that was actually shot outside of order, and saved to the end when we went to um, Seattle. Um, and he did a lot of those shots. Oh, so okay. direct. So like the episodes listed will have their main directors um, that we shot here in LA. Um, but because that was outside, it was him, and that's fine. Uh, that always like like make confused because I'm just like you'll shoot things out of order, and I'm like, damn. Yeah. Like, it'd be, but like it's good to all you guys, you know, when you to get into character for different episodes, and like because things might happen in a certain episode. 
and then you have to like kind of put it your... still fucks me up i'm just like what's it's... going on mind blowing. i'm just like whoa like but <laughs> shows you how talented you guys are that's why you guys are your guys are talented like that's you know it's amazing so it's just kudos to all you guys you could work so hard you get the cast crew everybody they're in- insane thanks baby that's all right um so l- for now for season three thank god there's a season three because i <laughs> my mind if there was not what do you think Lily will be getting up to? Or what do you hope to see? I mean, I can't wait to see what Leela says when she finds out what homegirl Kimberly did. Um, what do we think? What's your personal opinion about that, actually? What do we feel? Like, Elia's opinion? Yes. Like, my opinion outside of the show? Um I love it only because I am indeed a messy bitch. And so <laughs> like, I, the I, you know what I mean? Like, no, I wouldn't want that to happen in my friend group because yeah. I would cut a bitch. But on my TV, I'm just like, yes. Um, like, oh, she's like, I love it. I love it. And because it forces everyone in the friend group to choose. Like you know what I mean? Yeah. Like you, it creates like conflict because everything was beautiful conflict. Everything was, you know what yeah, I everything mean? Everything was too nice. Everything was like you're all too happy. Like the fuck. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Life is pain. <laughs> reality, reality. Oh, team. <laughs> I like. Yeah, I was like, I felt bad for Whitney. I was like, shit. But I was like, but this does create. You know. I love it. I love the the tea, the chaos, the what will happen. I have no idea, and I can't wait to see. Um, yeah, I'm all for it. Yeah, so I support that. I support that. It's but be- yeah, and I, but I'm excited to see what Lila would say about it. And yeah, because she did warn Kimberly already, been like, "This isn't gonna get messy." Like she warned her, so she did. it's gonna she did. be interesting. I yeah. And she works with both of them, so it's not like they can, like, hide it for too long. Exactly. You know? And, and Lila's smart. She's bound to catch them, like, hooking up in, like, the break. Yeah, like, yeah, like, bound like, to. And I can't what? wait. She Sit them down. Like, she y'all been fucking in my <laughs> office. Y'all can't fuck in my office. <laughs> Only I can to fuck in my office. Someone call the Pepsi delivery guy. It's like, that is not supposed to happen. That should be me. <laughs> Honestly, I could totally see her saying that. <laughs> she'll be like, she'll get more pissed that it wasn't her. Yeah. Like, she's like, yeah. Oh my God, 100%. Doing that, you know? <laughs> 100%. She'll be more pissed that she wasn't fucking in her office than the fact that they did. That would be fucking hilarious. We need that. I need that scene, Mindy. Yeah. All right, thank you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. But yeah, I cannot wait for to see Lila with dealing with that plus also um, i would hope there's a love interest or like she gets some love in next season of praying because it's about damn time i want her to see her i want to see her in a couple i think and i want to see her with somebody i said this before on some other interviews i want to see her with somebody that like makes her nervous that like oh, that God. makes her like like you like giddy you know what i mean yeah. that makes her like i don't know you know, yeah, something that makes takes her out of her comfort zone because she's such a confident person. And then yeah, 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 yeah. Kind yeah. of like, oh, like she kind of gets like taken aback. She's like, oh shit, what the fuck? This is yeah. Happen. And I was like, ooh, okay. But uh, can you let can you catch her take her breath away? Kind of thing. She's like, what the fuck? Like, yeah, I, yeah, 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 yeah. Shit like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that'd be so good. I am excited. But season three is gonna come out that sometime. But I'm excited because you're gonna slay as usual. Ah, um, ah. But also, someone is playing Captain Alveda in the... I am. Club, and the girl that is... When I found that out, I was immediately, immediately, like, fucking, like, yes. Like, I, have you shot scenes already for that? Is that all been done? Oh, oh, yeah. We wrapped, we wrapped um, some time ago. No, time is an illusion at all. I <laughs> just in my mind. Yeah, yeah. Um, but we, we wrapped... When did we wrap? God, I don't remember, but we wrap. Yes, yeah, the answer to that question is yes. Yeah. Um, um, yeah, and now it's in the hands of um the editors and, and yeah, yeah, and time will tell how how that's gonna come out. Yeah, do you, without without spoil. I don't want no spoilers. Don't spoil nothing. But oh, I can't. Uh, I would. No, 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 no. no so I, soon. Yeah, no, we are not doing that. But you reckon fans will be really excited to see what you guys have created. 
over there. Yeah. Yes. I, yeah. That's all yeah. I need to know. That's all I need to know. Say nothing less. Nothing else. Nothing's done. <laughs> nothing. I'm not going to get super Netflix. We're not going to get you in trouble. But like, that's it. That's all I need to know. <laughs> that was it. But I'm very excited for you because you're going to slay it. Slay it. You're going to be great. As Thank you. you always, I'm so excited. Like I saw that, I like jumped. I was like, oh my fucking God. Like, <laughs> Perfect. It's perfect. Uh, but girl, thank you so much for your time because I truly of course. it. Oh, this was so much fun to chat with you and just like get to meet you and like, you know, connect. It was great. I love it. Thanks so much. Of course. Keep doing you, baby. I love your channel and I love your reacts. You're so funny. I try. Um, I take off to you, baby. you. I mean, that's why you're my favorite character. I can relate. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. You just keep being the bright star that you are because I'll be following your career. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, I love you, girl. Thank you again for your time. Guys, this was my video with Ilya. Thank you again. And I appreciate you. So you have a lovely day. And um you too, baby. I cannot, cannot wait to see you in season three and in one piece and everything else you're going to do in the future. So, <laughs> thank, okay. you. <laughs> thank you. Oh, thank you so much. Thank really. you. Oh, oh, so Not in the band. He's so cute. He's the cutest ever. Okay. Bye. Bye. Bye, Ilya. Thank you again.